A South Carolina sheriff says it was no accident that this car ended up in a river with two young boys strapped to their car seats inside. We have this morning uh, served two warrants of murder against uh, Mrs. Dooley for the death of our children. Sheriff Larry Williams says 29-year-old Shaquan Dooley's initial story about what happened didn't add up. She first said her car ending up in the river was an accident. Williams says after further questioning, Dooley confessed that she was responsible for killing her two-year-old and 18-month-old children. At the conclusion of our lengthy evening on uh, last night, uh, the uh, determination uh, or the statement was made by the mother that she had uh, suffocated the children. Uh, and of course, the children were dead when they uh, was uh, placed into the water. That like this. Ramona Milhouse saw the nearly submerged car and she watched rescuers in action. I knew they were either unconscious or gone the way, you know, the way they acted. They just lifted them out and put them on that stretch and, you, you know, you could tell they were unconscious of uh, going. Sheriff Williams says he believes Dooley wanted to be free from the responsibility of caring for her children. She was a mother that was uh, unemployed. She had no means of taking care of her children. Uh, she lived with her mother and her mother was a very, uh, I guess, firm individual. Williams says Dooley and her mother argued the night before the crime. We believe this is a, a uh, direct response from Ms. Dooley. She, I believe she was fed up with her, her mother telling her that she couldn't uh, take care of the children or she wasn't taking care of the children and she just wanted to be free. The case reminds many of another South Carolina woman. Susan Smith is serving a life sentence after being convicted of driving her two young boys into a lake, killing them. Dooley is scheduled to make her first court appearance Wednesday. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.